as you can see folks I found a way of recording this as smooth as silk it is a bit bulky in how I'm doing it but if I can get the recording to be this smooth I mean can you see any problems with that at all no I recorded that fine so <laughs> yes the quality could be a bit better in the video but Really is that an issue? I mean the video file is tiny. So basically what I'm doing, I'm using several different programs, but basically it's about say 160 meg a minute, two, every two minutes, about 80 meg a minute. Uh, so rendering wouldn't be a big problem. So all I'm doing is using XSplit to capture the game. Let me just show you really quick what I'm doing. XSplit's capturing, well XSplit's holding the game so Bandicam can record it. So the main problem with Bandicam is it can't capture your live version of Minecraft. It can't hook into it. And I found with Bandicam itself if you record screen region because you can do target where is it? Rectangle on the screen. You can click on our little icon up here. Find window. Click the window and find it. But that's laggy. So using a program called DxTory, I'm actually trying it now. And you might be aware of the addition. I can get DxTory to directly capture and put that into XSplit and then Bandicam through DirectX OpenGL gets picked up by Bandic by XSplit and there you go yes that is a bit complicated if you think about it it's not hard to do but it's not too complicated it's just a few extra steps but as you can see the video quality has gone through the roof so you know I'm going to start this with Minecraft stuff because that's one problem I've had. One is file size. So, you know, 30 minute video is 600 megs. <sighs> it's ridiculous. It's beautiful. Sorry, I had a niche. So, you know, it's what I found it out about half one in the morning. And it works wonders. So, you know, that's one good way of getting around it. And the best thing about it is. I think I turned one setting down. Oh, I've got smooth lighting on, yeah, graphics on fancy, render distance far, max FPS. It could, I I could go balanced, but I'll go max FPS just because I get the extra FPS. It doesn't seem to bother it. View but video bobbing. I haven't tried on to open GL. Does that affect the frame rate? Yeah. I think it does. Yes, yeah, definitely stuff. See how see how um, it's it's still smooth. But if I leave open gel off, I don't really need open gel on, so turn that back off. And we'll look, voila. Smooth as silk. Now that's smooth. See, as you can see, the frame rate is pretty decent. I'm probably losing about 10 frames a second, but to play, you wouldn't even notice. So, yeah. Pretty gold, pretty gold start. So, I'm really going to push this Minecraft stuff now. And I'm going to stop worrying about, because the major worry I have with Minecraft is oh, that I won't know what to do. But at the end of the day, be creative, be yourself, don't lock yourself into that train of thought because and you are stupid. But yeah. I wanna get some Minecraft when I get it up. So I'm really tempted to try and bang out quite a few videos of it. So we'll see. We will see. But yep, yeah, I'm gonna do a couple of hours recording and get to bit. So hopefully I'll be up in time to do the end yeah, do the editing of the dialog for yesterday. For Thursday. And hopefully soon I can get back into schedule and release them back out on the day that I do them. We'll see. <laughs> we'll definitely have to see about that one. 
Well, hello everyone, good morning. This is D Log number 41, doing really well. Uh, sorry, it started really late, it's what, 3 o'clock in the afternoon. I got up, had to go shopping, help mum go shopping. Got the D Log rendered, it's going up in a minute. And then I'm going to have to do a reinstall of my system. The problem is, the problem at the moment I'm having is when I try and record a Bandicam, it locks up. And the system is starting to act up a little bit anyway, so. It's a good sign that I should just reinstall the system, so hopefully that'll fix it. Luckily, all my stuff's on different hard drives, so it's just literally plug the external in, reinstall Windows 7, and keep moving. So I better get this underway, otherwise it'll take forever. Because I'm not going to have too long today to do much anyway because of stuff. And I got that interview tomorrow, of course, so I can't really mess about it. So anyway, I'll see you guys in a bit once everything is sorted. Well, Windows is a new, I've reinstalled it. Now I'm just going through and sorting all the crap out. Uh, I'm just sorting out the hard drives and stuff, so hopefully I'll get all my list of stuff installed again. That's basically all the stuff I've got to install, plus probably more. So let's get this up. I have to keep working out, it's going to take a while to do. But I don't seem to be getting any many videos out, really. But we'll see. Hopefully I can get this done within the next couple of hours. Oh! Network just went down. Then again, I'm doing updates, that's probably why. Anyway, moving on. So, I do apologise, today has been a bit of a slow vlog. I've had a bit of a, it's been a crap day, really. There's not much I can talk about too much yet. It's going to turn the light on, it's too dark. But my, I had a scare. Basically, I've reinstalled everything and I used Google Drive to back up my Minecraft stuff. And I exclusively backed up the Minecraft in Google Drive. But look at the folder. Empty. So it seems I may have lost it. But, touch wood, I'm going to just check on this and I'll be back with you in a moment, I think, hopefully. I was going to check something before I actually say this on the vlog. Well, nope. Google Drive has failed me. It said it backed it up but I've lost my Minecraft world. Great stuff. One thing I was scared of doing and it's completely gone. I'm fucking furious. And when I get mad I get quiet because I just don't like things like that happening. I thought I found it. Nope, the world's gone so now I'm at a complete loss what to do. I can't believe, believe it's gone. I mean, the texture packs I can get back, the mods I can get back. But the fact that the look, the whole world's gone, I can't do anything with it. Unless I did it to somewhere else. Actually, I better check that as well. I'm really desperate right now. Nope, gone. Completely gone. I'm gonna have to just start again. Luckily enough, I'm not too far into it. But the thing is, I've got seven episodes up. And now, how do I go about I'm going to try and find out what I can do because I don't want to. I don't want to start again if I have to help it. It's just I enjoyed it so much doing that, and it was a lot of fun. I mean, you know, I guess on a positive note, I've not lost all the content. Basically, everything you see up on the channel for Minecraft is what I've done. There's no off-camera stuff I've not done. There's no new videos for that area. But I don't know. I really don't know now. I have to think about what to do, but yeah, uh, stay positive. The system is hopefully back to normal, so you know, patch it up. You know, I've just thought I've lost more stuff. No, I haven't, those are all backed up. That's fine, that's fine. I haven't lost everything, but what can I do? Google Drive failed me. I don't know if it's a user error, so. You know, I'm just going to have to watch what they do with Google Drive and make sure I do it right. But it's all gone. So, I'm going to go to bed soon anyway. I'm going to get up in the morning. I'm just tired and stuff. It doesn't help. So, I hope you are all well. Thanks again for watching my vlog today. I will see you all tomorrow. Have a good day. Have a good night. Thank you all for watching and take care. Adios.